I'm really bored. Today is <sighs> not Nothing that really exciting. happened. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> okay, look where we are. It's where not Toronto. <laughs> so we are here and we are super excited. Today we're prepping, but tomorrow we are meeting our idol. We're meeting and filming with Neil deGrasse Tyson for an interview on Tech Insider. And then the next hour, <laughs> what are we doing? We're, we're gonna, gonna be with Instagram. Bill Nye filming another video that's gonna for go our on our channel. channel. He's like so nervous to meet them. Like, Neil deGrasse Tyson is A, so smart, mm -hmm. B, hilarious, it's C, fine. so accomplished. Like, he's like done all this academic research and stuff. I think he grew up in New York. And we'll find New York. Out You're even cool if you just live in New York. <laughs> go to the museum today. Maybe. Okay, let's go to science museum. <laughs> Mitch, do you like New York City? Um, anywhere I can find yummy green food, I like, and I believe we can. Yeah. <laughs> we are in beautiful Central Park, mm. walking to the American <laughs> Museum of Natural History, and look where we are. Is this the pigeon mice from Macaulay Home Alone? I've seen Macaulay Culkin. I think we're <laughs> not sure. It? Like, you know that part in Home Alone 2, right? Yeah, with the pigeons. Where he's like in Central Park and then there's a lady with like the pigeons and the food. And but the... I think there's a lot of bridges like this and we literally just walked into Central Park for like literally 30 seconds Wait, and like, we're like, Home Alone! American film! What? Elm. American Elm. Oh. <laughs> it says American Elm, not American, American Elm, film. like the type of tree. <laughs> anyway, Central Park's really cool. Well, these are American Elm trees, yeah. more, That's importantly, more important. Who important. Who needs the, the Museum of Natural History when you've got real natural history right in front of you, right, Mitch? New York is wild because there's literally 9 million people or about. So it's so cool that in the middle of New York there is a ginormous park that's really tranquil. And we're like, there's not that many people around us right now. Hello, here they come. Run. <laughs> Run. Run. We've literally been Snapchatting and, and doing vlogging. like, no, most like Snapchat and Instagram story, this like Q&A that we've been trying to do because we put a Q&A on these, I thought. And, and I just saw a mouse. Whatever. <laughs> and literally everyone's just looking at us and like la laughing in our faces because we're just like, oh my god, what's your favorite dog? And then, but now we're also fully we lost, lost because there's Central all these Park. fences. We're like, and we turn right and then on there. <laughs> so now we're like lost. But this is what happens, kids, when you have to run a social media program. <laughs> Hayden Planetarium's part of it, and that's what Neil deGrasse Tyson is the head of, who we're gonna just like see tomorrow, so we're gonna go look at it. <laughs> I don't know if this is intentional, but the ground kind of looks like stars, okay. right? Space. Right? Space. <laughs> this is so cool. <laughs> and we just walked in, we're like, is it free? <laughs> we have witnessed the unfolding of its 13.7 billion year history. <clears throat> A history that began with the Big Bang. <gasps> Liam Neeson. <laughs> Grass Tyson made this for you, Mitch. He made it all for you. Wow. That's really him right there. What? Oh my god. <laughs> Wait. That's like, really I'm really not Grass kidding. Tyson. Neil deGrasse Tyson is right there. <laughs> oh my god, do you think, should, should we go say hi? This is the ultimate test. Mitch, I'm freaking out. What do we do? We're gonna see him tomorrow, does he know? Should we be like, do you know who we are? <laughs> Oh, oh my god. Mitch, 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 what are you gonna do? Are you gonna go say hi to him? No, I think I'm too nervous to just walk up and randomly say hi. But we should, we should like, just go up and be like, we're gonna be on your thing tomorrow. <laughs> we could. Okay, so we were mentally preparing to meet Neil deGrasse Tyson tomorrow, but he's literally, literally. right there. He's <laughs> and look at, he's saying hi to all these kids. Yeah. And they're all learning That's about so the observable cool. universe. This is beautiful, I love it. <laughs> and Neil deGrasse Tyson. You know you're at a science museum when you there's a bunch of old dead straight white guys. Sup Galileo. <laughs> it says that they all thought that they the earth was the center of the universe. Little did they know. <laughs> Bye buddy! <laughs> okay, so we were so close yet so far from Neil deGrasse Tyson because there were a lot of people we didn't want to interrupt and we're also just like nervous. We're so bad at this. So close yet so far, kind of like Saturn. I mean it's close if you think like about anybody, all of really. space, yeah. but it's far when you think about the fact that we've never been there. Greg is about to enter his happy place right now because there's a whale over there. I think it's a blue whale and it's going to come to life when it sees me because I'm magic! This is Greg. I recognize you! <laughs> Hi! I'm really happy. 
Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. It's huge and it's still amazing, but obviously if you wake up. What would you do if you were yeah, what would you do if you're this close to a whale? To a blue whale? Mm -hmm. <laughs> That'd be really amazing. That'd be so rare. Yo, Mitch, I know you're like that, but I got a question for you. Would you tap and mate with a Neanderthal? Think that's cute? If it was nice to me. Think he's cute? <laughs> If anyone treats me well, then you know I treat them well back. <laughs> okay, so we are learning about something. That a really cool exhibit. Yeah, and it reminds us of what we knew, but it's just cool to see it visually and just like have it solidified. Because when we went up into northern Canada, really far up, up there, that's where we were. We were with Inuit people, and the Inuit people looked very similar to like, well I thought South American people. Mm -hmm. Or even Asian people, I thought, like a mix of, and, and now we're actually looking at a map that describes the, the travel paths of like prehistoric Homo sapiens, and we can see, we'll show you on here what happens. And oh. they literally come from Asia, come across through where Alaska is now, down North America into South America, and they are the first Americans. Mm -hmm. And I just feel like going there and learning about their culture and learning about what happened when us, white people and ancestors, or not necessarily white people, came people like who came later. Tens of thousands of years later. <laughs> and completely had a complete cultural genocide of their culture. I don't know, it's just one of those things where it's like, they, they put it here, the first Americans, and they are. They are the first Americans, something to remember, and it's just really fascinating to like see, see the migratory path of it. And to have just seen Canadian people who True. live in, in Arctic, North Canada, who've yes. been here for so long. Mm -hmm. They are in Asia, and they come over here, and back then there would have been less water, so they cross over, and they come all the way down, like they're eating seafood, until they get to South America. <laughs> Fascinating. So we just met up with our friend Mark in this city. He used to live here in New York, and we went for dinner with him. But look what he bought me. Can you see it? It's a little pin, and it's ramen. It's a ramen pin. This is so nice. And then also this. <laughs> Too young to hang next to This is currently Woods Candy House. Cheers! Oh my god, it's so good. Good morning! Okay, so today is the day that we're gonna go chill with Neil deGrasse Tyson and Bill Nye. But there was one small little problem that we had, and that was that I threw my back out this morning. <laughs> yeah, I was really sad. He was like, Frank, can you help? It's still in a lot of pain, but I'm just like, I have to power through now. I don't have a choice. I hope you're okay. So hopefully I'm not in, like, with them, our idols, literally like, mm, mm. But we're gonna make it through. Tyson and Bill Nye will They've inspired my body. Here, ready to film. There's the, the Here's the cute seats. little, whoa, look at the cute little set. And I'll look, whoa, there's a lot of cameras going on. <laughs> a lot of nice cameras. Are you we excited? just got a nice camera, I thought it was a big deal. <laughs> no. I'm really bored. Today is not Nothing really exciting. happened. To ah! <laughs> hey, Neil, how's it going? Come back, come back. Come, come back. back, we have to ask, how was our interview? Did we do okay? Uh, I don't know, that is for others to judge. Oh, true. Uh, okay. Never for me. <laughs> you weren't judging us the whole time? No, yeah. I was not judging you the whole time, oh, even if nice. it felt like it. <laughs> no, I was judging you in all positive ways. Okay. <laughs> uh, not so much judging, but observing that you guys occupy uh, a unique niche mm -hmm. in the spectrum of science education. <laughs> but rather, I'd rather call it <laughs> science enlightenment. <laughs> <laughs> well, thank you. <laughs> and it's really nice to see you here close in the flesh because we do have footage on this camera of stalking you from a distance. Oh, yesterday. Oh, really? Yeah, we were like, wait, yeah. he's down there. Yeah. He's I, did some, I did see some like, <laughs> people shadowing me yesterday. I didn't know <laughs> we, we really, you what guys that was. Yeah, so now well, we have proof, oh, guys. We, didn't, we actually came here to see you. <laughs> Yeah, well, thank you very much for the fun you. time. Any any cool facts for our vlog? They love you. That you're like the <laughs> idol of many of our vlog. So if you have anything you want to say to young aspiring scientists or people interested, oh, let them know. Uh, science is fun and it's also hard. Mm -hmm. And most of the greatest things you will do in life will be what rises up after you did something hard. <laughs> That's very that's true. Very nice. and that's, right? Because yeah. if it was easy, then everyone would have done it, and then there'd be nothing interesting or special about it. So work really so, hard. So celebrate the hard work, recognizing that what comes out on the other side is a rare expression of human creativity. Wow. Thank you. Thank that you. was real. That was really him. He Hold said on that. to that. <laughs> <laughs> now we have a quick lunch here, and then we're gonna go film with Bill Nye. How do you feel? This is like the most amazing day ever. 
Oh, this one's just so cute. Oh, well, it looks so good. I haven't had it yet. The grass eisen was so nice, and he, like, I don't know, made me laugh so hard. I love him. I'm on adrenaline. <laughs> and now you're ready for Bill? I'm ready for Bill. What? Neil and Bill, our new best boom, friends. Boom, 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 boom. We're at the YouTube Space New York, oh. ready to film. Got all the gear. I think we're ready. Cuties. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, we even signed it. Nice. Oh my god, it's science. All that shit on eBay. <laughs> but also, so, look, more importantly, look at this king. Look at this king. Hello. You look like a camp counselor right now with that yeah. hair. Hi, I'll show you. Uh, but actually, um, uh, so this is our studio for the day. Uh, duh, it's half science. It says 9 a.m. We were a little late. Did not realize we had it all day. <laughs> um, so we got a nice, this is our world, our white space world that he's gonna stand and dance around it. <laughs> and literally we said don't wear a white shirt for obvious <laughs> oh, reasons. Yeah, <gasps> he's not. We didn't tell him that. Oh, I'm sure it's fine. Even if I'm not sure, like, we'll just have to work with that. A little late now, um, but yeah. So we're gonna have him here, and like last time, a little more, more back and forth than our last video with him. So he'll do some scenes where we draw around him, and then we'll cut in and do voiceover with animation. Life is amazing. It's very exciting. We're super pumped. My back is still broken, but the camera's helping me get adrenaline, and I'm sure when he arrives, I'll have adrenaline. <laughs> I'm in pain. <laughs> Another important thing to do at YouTube Spaces is find food. Thanks, Google. <laughs> We go. Big bar. Oh. oh gosh, I have to send all these emails. It's a huge classified file. Mr. President, what do I do? I don't know. The country's in ruins. <laughs> it's your fault. I can help with this. You and I drink fresh water. Water with no salt in it. Okay, look who we're oh, with. another idol. <laughs> so how did you like filming for ASAP Science? It's the most fun anyone could ever have oh, anywhere. Oh wow, thank no, it's you. Great. <laughs> You this guys is the do a good job. You're so skilled. Got to You're so, it's great. Yeah, we've yeah. done this before. Do you remember that? Asteroids, yes. Yeah. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, good. Okay. Well, how that's, can I tell you? What do you I don't know. We were worried about the ice and asteroids. These are science <laughs> problems, everybody. These are serious business. You do not want the Earth to get hit with an asteroid. You don't want to melt all the ice. These are big, important things that the ASAPsters are uh, getting you involved with. <laughs> that's a very good term. So we're going to be animating around you. It's going to be great. That's why you're on this white backdrop. <laughs> So what you see is going to come to life even more. How is that possible? I don't know. You're very expressive. It was great. <laughs> Here, how about this? Our audience obviously loves you. They're huge science fans. What advice can you give to them if, about science, or what words of inspiration can, uh, can words, we supply? <laughs> uh, science is the best idea humans have ever had. Follow your passion. Uh, whatever you're interested in, even if it's not science, just main, make sure you appreciate this process, this natural philosophy that has enabled us with our little brains to understand the universe. It's amazing. Turn it up loud. <laughs> Thank you. Thanks, yes. Hopefully Thanks, that inspires you guys. <laughs> My back's still broken. It feels today, you know, new experiences, they make new pathways in your brain and they slow down time. I said brain. I'm so sorry. <laughs> That's the time. And they slow down time and today feels like a week. It's been a week, but I feel like they both were the best such way. amazing, inspiring people. Awesome to work with, had a really fun time. And oh, hi. Oh, this is better. <laughs> oh, my hair looks stupid. Well, like my new necklace. It's a YouTube. <laughs> Anyways, it was great. We it's love you It's been a cool all. experience. Hopefully, you find it cool to like see Bill and I and the other guys Tyson and are as starstruck as we were. Um, the videos will be coming out soon. We love you all. We're gonna be vlogging more. So we'll see you again soon. Peace.